I'm Anil Kumar and here is a thinking question on vertical and horizontal asymptotes. The question is, find the constants a and b such that the graph of the function defined by f of x equals to ax plus 3 divided by 2 minus bx will have a vertical asymptote at x equals to 4 and horizontal asymptote at y equals to minus 5. You can pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. Here are two simple steps to do the following. First step is find the vertical asymptote, right? So vertical asymptote is given to us at x equals to 4, right? So vertical asymptote is at x equals to 4. That really means that the denominator will be 0 for x equals to 4. That is what it means. So we can substitute 4 for x here. So we get 2 minus b times 4. That should be equal to 0. Now solve for b. That means we have we can rearrange this. 4b equals to 2 or b equals to 2 over 4, which is half. So we get value of b as half or 0 0.5 correct so that is the first part now the second part of this equation is to find the constant a now constant a is related with the horizontal asymptote so how do you relate a and b for horizontal asymptote well the degree of both numerator and denominator is same and therefore horizontal asymptote will be ratio of leading coefficients of numerator and denominator. So the horizontal asymptote is at y equals to, it is given to us at y equals to minus 5, but actually speaking, it will be at a over minus b, right? So y should be equals to a over minus b, right? Minus b. That is another way of finding horizontal asymptote, right? If x is very, very large, denominator will be minus b and the numerator will be a correct so so we get horizontal asymptote as a over minus b it is given to us as equal to minus 5 we have just found that b is half right so we know that b equals to half we can substitute b and find a right so what we get from here is a equals to minus 5 times minus b which is minus 5 times minus of half right minus half so when you do what you get you get plus 5 over 2 so the value of a is 5 over 2 so that is how you can actually find the function right so we can write down f of x as 5 over 2 or 2.5 so you could write this as 5 over 2a plus 3 divided by 2 minus half x correct so that is how you can find i mean this is not a but x we found a and b right so that is how you can find the function so clearly the answer for us is that we'll write down answer here a is equals to 5 over 2 or 2.5 and b is equals to half so that is how you can find the solution for this problem i hope that helps thank you and all the best